Late breaking developments over a proposal to build hundreds of homes in the town of Smithfield. The development is planned along Battery Park Road. And more than 100 residents showed up during a marathon town council meeting tonight, speaking out against the project, saying the roads could not handle this project. But despite their concerns, a vote happened just a short while ago. News 3 reporter Antoinette Del Bell has been following this story and joins us now live. And Antoinette, how did that vote go down? Well, Kurt, so many people walking out of that meeting tonight just disappointed and feeling defeated. Many saying that the town board members already had their mind up before this hearing even began tonight. The town ultimately deciding in a five to two vote in favor of the project. <laughs> A very spirited and passionate crowd turning out Tuesday during the nearly four hour town council meeting. It was standing room only as one by one folks in Smithfield voiced their opposition to a massive development project on Mallory and Scott Farms. Virginia Beach based developer Napolitano Homes is proposing to build 812 houses, including single family homes, townhomes and duplexes. We understand that no one likes change. But change is necessary to grow. As one. Re but neighbors aren't buying it. They say the project is too big, will create a traffic nightmare, and destroy the town's character. We are a small town, not a city. That is the draw of Smithfield. That is why many of us live here. That's why I came here. That's why I'm staying here. And if we allow overdevelopment to include these homogenous looking homes and complexes, we lose the lifestyle that we've all come to love. Neighbors pleading with council members to listen to their concerns and vote against approving the project. I have heard that some of you all feel that you owe it or we owe it to the applicant to approve. But really, don't you owe it to us? Yeah. Yeah your obligation as council members that have been voted into office by the constituents of this town is to do what is best for this town and best for your constituents. Traffic congestion is a major concern on the two lane highway that folks say is already busy. The extreme pressure on our roads is already felt by all of us who have to commute that Nike Park Battery Park intersection every day. Adding another 800 houses, I don't care what kind of rotary or what kind of turn lanes go in, it's not going to take the pressure off our two lane roads with big ditches on both sides. Mr. Napolitano has yet to prove to the members of this community how this mega development will benefit the current citizens. The developer argues traffic will be controlled by possibly building more roads, adding the project will bring more life to the area, including attracting hospitals and more retail. This kind of development brings more retail, specialty shops, hardware stores, etc. Right now, there are storefronts and shopping centers in the town limits that are empty. And I just spoke with the developer just a short time ago as the meeting was wrapping up. He says he's happy with the outcome and he's sensitive to what the public was saying here tonight. And when asked why he just doesn't downsize the project even more to what the area is already zoned for, he says he already did downsize the project that was never part of the original plan. And this revised and now approved plan, this new plan, actually adds more land. Live in Smithfield, Antoinette Elbel, News 3.